Hello there humans, welcome back to another Hoi4 video. Today we are making Japan a world leader and I'm gonna use the most broken strategy that I know to do it. So let's get right into it. We're gonna be building only military factories because there is a magical place in the world that we are going to take care of and they got all the civilian factories we can imagine. So first we are going to justify on British Malaya and you might think well they are UK's puppet how are you gonna get there across the world? Well let's just say I know a guy. Are you playing as Japan and you don't have enough military factories? Well you just come here do this click and you just got four military factories for nothing. Do you also not have enough political power to get your war economy up? Well, Japan has a solution for that too. You just click on this, on this focus and in 70 days you're done. And justification is done. So let's set up our navy here. That's definitely gonna beat the British one, even though we didn't do any research for it. <laughs> no doctrine, no nothing. Right there. There, and let's declare war on Malaya and let's go get them. Come on, let's just take Dover and the war should be, yep, over. Take Dover and war is over. <laughs> and the peace deal looks like this. We puppeted pretty much everything, took some spots with oil and rubber. The next on the list, Canada. And guess who are they being guaranteed by? <laughs> oh yeah. And the justification is done. It's time to just start another war I guess and America is gonna join and we are gonna call in the British just so they do something with their navy they got no divisions but their navy is still massive Springfield, oh, oh shit, I guess if you don't bother Chinese they bother you, <laughs> no apology, that's, that's really not good. 
Yeah, we're just gonna get war goal on them. Free war goal. No need for bridges and shit. And United States is gone. Only Canada left. And Canada is gone too. So we get everything. And this is the peace deal. I got Americans to take care of all of Canada and just... I don't have to worry about that side at all. And Chinese apparently can't wait for this war. I am so sorry I am late. I had to go around the world just to come back right here to deal with you. And Germany declared war on Czechoslovakia. I guess they got denied on Sudeterland. It's... <laughs> this is really... Everything just goes to shit when you don't play historically. <laughs> and France didn't do shit either. I am so sorry I couldn't be here earlier, but here I am now. Oh yeah, everybody join in on this. Yep. We got planes and we are ready to go. And Americans... What the fuck is... Why are they this color? What the fuck happened to them? Oh yeah, Germans are now gonna take over Poland. I don't think so. anyone's gonna fucking stop them. Nope. They are all 1v1. This is just horrible for Poland. And Germany got to do a peace deal with Poland, so they got them annexed. This is very, very nice. So Finland is gonna go to war with the Soviets and Germany annexed Luxembourg. Didn't France join? They did. But they didn't make any faction. <laughs> so Germany is just gonna annex anything they just... anything that capitulates instantly just peace deal and it's done. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Confederate States of America demand apology and compensation. In response to our sinking of US earlier this week, the Confederate States of America has demanded an apology, punishment of the officers involved, blah, blah, blah. who gives a fuck? Are you fucking- they are my puppet, so I can agree and lose a hundred political power or gain a hundred political power and have no consequences. Uh, this is very hard choice. What is this now? Germany annexing Netherlands. Jesus, they just keep annexing shit. And these guys join them as well. What is... Oh, France? When the fuck did France die? Yeah, and they split... Germans split the France with Italy. Are they gonna create Vichy France? Like, I guess not. It's just... <laughs> Italy and Germany, that's it. No more France. Fuck, Th that's insane. Yes, finally done. Japan looking thick already, but we are just starting. 
For some reason, my American puppet has a war goal against Denmark. Fucking Denmark. So on this side, there is only one democratic country that can actually do some damage to me, and it's not gonna be there for very long. Oh, Italy is getting that Roman Empire boner. They're declaring war on Yugoslavia. You still need to take care of Croatia and uh, Yugoslavia is probably gonna call them in. They have quite some divisions. But yeah, they are surrounded. But still missing Greece. You can't have a Roman Empire without Greece. And yeah, I fucking knew it. <laughs> there you go. Time to lose the war. And Mexicans are done as well. We are not giving this to Americans. This is all for us. Yes. You know that feeling when you don't have a manpower and you need to garrison your country? You just get Americans to do all the work and you get your people back to do whatever the fuck you want with them. Oh shit, Italy actually did it. They're looking very Roman-y. <laughs> and what the fuck did Hungary do? We're just slowly moving towards Europe and apparently Australia and the Allies are guaranteeing Portugal. Well, I guess. It's another fight with the Allies that are really fucking weak now. Oh yeah, we're about to look even better. Look at this. Oh, it's so juicy. And finally it happened. Germany declared war on Soviet Union. And Germany has, oh yeah, way more factories than Soviets. And Italy is massive as well. I don't know what the fuck Soviet's gonna do now. Come on, oh yeah, capitulated. Wait, is that, was that fall of Leningrad? The war has just started. We, <laughs> look, Germans did a naval invasion. Holy fucking shit, <laughs> Germany is doing amazing right now. Jesus Christ, can you spot somebody that is not in the faction and has a really good position? Oh yeah, it's Franco. We are coming for you, bro. Germans are actually advancing quite quickly in the Soviet Union and casualties are absolutely insane. I don't think Soviets can handle all this. Justifications for Franco is ready, but let me just finish the war with allies. Come on. And that's done. No more allies. It's just Japan and... Well, Japan. And don't worry bro, I didn't forget about you. I am here to take care of you as well. But this is gonna be a little bit slow war, my tanks are still on the way. Germans are really not messing around. Like, they are so deep in the Soviet Union right now. This is absolutely insane. Oh yeah, it's over. So let's see how this is gonna go. <laughs> it should go well. So we are ready to declare war on Italy. And let's hope Germany just doesn't do anything. They're too busy with the Soviets and uh, we might have a chance to capitulate Italy.
holy shit, I just clicked on all volunteers that they sent me. The These forces from my puppets, there are 200 divisions just standing there. <laughs> I'm just gonna slap them on the German border so they don't join the war. Let's scare the Germans. Italians are on the run with so many casualties they are not gonna stop us now and Germany still didn't give a fuck to join <laughs> so that's also good yep we get a peace deal to take <laughs> pretty much everything and we took Italy and most of the Balkans and <laughs> this is gonna look like AIDS now look how many divisions are encircled <laughs> this is a fucking nightmare for Germany. I don't know if this is beautiful or disgusting, but it's just absolutely just look at this. <laughs> How many divisions are stuck there? Fall of Moscow. I mean, Germany is just unstoppable at this point. So I'm gonna try and take out Bulgaria because they ran out of peace deals somehow and see if Germans are gonna join this time. I guess <laughs> they're just again gonna ignore it, just like with Italy. So let's see how this goes. Yep, Germans didn't care about Bulgarians at all. So I guess there is nothing else to do now but to invade Germany and also Soviet Union. I am coming for you both. 20 days for you and should be 20 days for them. Yup. Ready. And we can declare war on both of them. I'm gonna be like that referee when those two kids fight. <laughs> he beats the shit out of both. Oh, was that a hundred or what? <laughs> How many was that? Alright, let's give it a go and try and encircle them here. I mean, they kept pushing. I kept pushing on the other side it's looking like we could do something just Switzerland has to remain neutral and we got them for sure yep we got them encircled that's quite a lot of divisions there very nice what happened oh Germany took over Soviet Union The war is finally over. Everything is ours now. It's gonna take a while <laughs> to take all states. <laughs> That's just gonna be a lot of white everywhere. And done. Oh, we got these as well. 
Okay, done. Yes! And that would be it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, leave a like. Maybe comment. And if you are scared that you will never find me again, make sure you subscribe.